going to get uh, Johnny Lewis, Stephen Leggett, Brett Wilson, uh, Pete Harper, and the boys uh, going through there. So uh, Johnny Steve, of course, uh, uh, they'll be also doubling up in the actual uh, main Formula One class as well. So European and American races. Bears is uh, something that uh, has been uh, a very, very passionate class here in New Zealand for many years, but uh, was also the, the one that was missing in there. That's why a lot of people would say the S at the end put the Z, as uh, quite often an S and a Z are used in vocabulary, but uh, more importantly, that uh, the Z stood for New Zealand because this is where the Britain motorcycle fitted in the world. So when it was World Bears Racing, of course, the Britain our own New Zealand made motorcycle but in there 54 for Johnny good work so we go back to the 979 in there look into the 70 of uh, Brett and now back here to the uh, uh, 619 of uh, Pete Harper Pete's always been a Ducati fan and, uh, loves it here at the moment so uh, these boys uh, effectively you've got uh, two riders out of Nelson one from Christchurch and Stephen out of uh, Morgan New Chicane here at the corner, 54 for Johnny, uh, well in control at the moment, 79 for Stephen Leggett, up to uh, the 70 of uh, Brett Wilson, those two are on Aprilias, so two Ducatis and two Aprilias for our uh, Bears lineup. so I think they're all the, uh, the E, the European, the uh, Italian stallions of uh, motorcycle manufacturers, so uh, F1 a Formula 1 class, effectively being that it's uh, a quicker open capacity bikes, and uh, just more competitors in our uh, it because uh, three of them are double classing with the actual uh, F1 class itself so a uh, easy race to uh, control without uh, the worry of lappers uh, uh, four uh, well-heeled riders there you go 54 for Johnny Lewis the Nelson uh, builder outside of uh, 79 uh, Wanganui's uh, Stephen uh, Leggett with uh, the 70 now of uh, Christchurch's uh, Brett Wilson and uh, that leaves, uh, Pete Harper making all the noise on the Ducati. And this racing, of course, brought to us by Ducati Spears as well. Yeah, well said, actually. Uh, Heath Whitaker uh, actually uh, crashing at uh, Teratonga yesterday, so uh, Heath would have been one uh, deservedly in this class. He'd have been a, a a top three for sure would uh, certainly have pushed Johnny along. So uh, bad luck to Heath, uh, resting up at the moment, wishing him all a speedy recovery. Didn't need to get through there with uh, Brett Wilson as well. So our uh, Ducati Spears sponsored uh, F1 Bears lineup. No British, no American, so uh, no B, no A. Bears fan, of course, will be in uh, heaven just uh, two weeks away to the uh, legendary Sound of Thunder event, a long time hosted at uh, Ruapuna, and uh, I'm sure a mega turnout that event is always attracting them from uh, near and far. They come from Australia, they'll be uh, in uh, big force coming down, it's effectively the biggest Bears event in New Zealand. Himself, uh, well placed around the circuit, meaning that uh, they're not really causing any uh, interference to each other. Necessarily handlebar to handlebar exciting racing, but uh, for these guys, they'll be showing their best when it comes up to the uh, open F1 field a little later in our program. 619 with uh, Pete Harper, and uh, there we are already. And the uh, checkered flag, perfect timing for Johnny as he's. Uh, would have been this near to being on the tail there. Thank you. Here in New Zealand flyby today, we're not even paying any extra for it as well, so that's uh, it's a bonus. That one, didn't, that one didn't seem as bad as the ATR, which came in earlier. That was almost coming in sideways, so I think the, uh, the wind above us might be a bit quieter as it is here at ground level as well. There we go, no changes, in fact, perfect compared to what they did for qualifying. Johnny Lewis, uh, Stephen Leggett, Brett Wilson and Pete Harper.